Do you know that every human on this earth has a connection with the sand? Do you know that every human on this earth has a connection with the mother earth? Yes. And do you also know that a lot of destinies has been buried on this particular land or this particular ground that you and I is stepping on? Do you know that a lot of people glory, a lot of people marital settlement has been caged, has been seized, has been manipulated using the power of the earth, the power of the sun, the power of the nation. But do you also know that you as a person, you can still use this method to liberate yourself. And let me tell you the truth. Sun is one of the spiritual process of making prayers if you don't know yes i've made this video quite long ago and there was a lot of testimonies when i talk about testimonies i mean so much testimonies on this yes everything under this earth is a blessing to us some people are using it in a negative part you can as well use it in a positive part way to liberate and to save yourself Yes, so in today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you another powerful way on how to use sand. Yes, you help me. How to use sand to bless yourself, to liberate yourself, to stop this sickness, to stop this rejection, to stop this disappointment, fail you, every down things that you are passing through in life that did not please you. Maybe you prayed, you fasted, you've gone to so many places, and it seems as if God is not answering. Let me tell you, we are about to do the practical process of the liberation and let me tell you this is the end of that particular thing so if this sounds interesting to you make sure you follow me to the end of this video because i know that after this your life will never remain the same and you will surely come back and say promise thank you for this secret and thanks to god almighty for all this benefit to us guys stay tuned while i share with you welcome back to my channel on my page Thank you for stopping by. If you are new or you are seeing me for the first time, you are highly welcome. Here I share more tips on how to use natural things for prayer. So if this sounds interesting to you, please do subscribe or follow me. Turn on the bell notification, select all, so you don't miss out any of my videos. Okay, I love you and God bless you for joining the big family. If you are a returning subscriber, you are highly welcome today. May the good Lord bless you and keep you for me. Okay. All right, guys. In today's video, I want to share with us once more how to use sand for prayer. Yes, how to use sand either for liberation, for blessing, or for every down thing that you wish or you want God to do for you. But before I dive into the video, please, I want to beg you to disregard any number you see in the comment section. Please don't fall a victim of scam. There's a whole lot of scammers opening pages, channels with my names and my picture. Please don't fall victim. Remember, I don't do consultation. Remember, I don't take money to answer your question. So if you have any question, go ahead and ask. If I know it, I will definitely answer. If I don't know, Omar, we will find solutions to that questions. All right? Okay. Now, to be honest with you, sound is very, very powerful. Yes. Now, you and I that every human on earth has a connection with sand. How? Whenever a man is gone, you understand what I mean? Whenever a man is gone, you definitely go back to the sand, to the ashes, to the mother earth. Yes. When things are not going well in your life, when things are going opposite of life, when things are going upside down, when you see that things is happening, a lot of tragedy, a lot of evil, a lot of Thing is happening in your life. Probably you've prayed, you fasted. Yes, when I'm saying this, I am saying it because I have already had an encounter with a lot of people that have shared their experience, that shared a lot of their the knowledge, like what they have gone through. But using the natural things coupled with their prayers and faith, God come true for them. So God is about to come true for you using this method now the best time to make this prayer is between morning and night that is 12 o'clock and um, so you can do this prayer either by 12 by 1 by 2 or by 3 any of this time is fine i am not saying you should pray from morning to night and all that no 
joining of this time. But if you can pray from that 12 to 3, Omo, oh congratulations. All right? It's very, very good and very, very powerful. Okay, guys. Now, this is what you need to do. Go and get a sand. Go and get a sand. Do you know that all these things that are being... Everything that God created is a being. You can talk to them. You can speak. You have this power. God has given you this ability. God has given you this power to speak into existence and it comes to pass. Yes. Maybe probably you packed into a place or you packed into a shop and you notice that, oh, this is not why I packed into this place. You are seeing the opposite of life and all that. Get at the point of that particular place. Pack a sand. Go back to your house. When it's 12 o'clock midnight, now begin to pray. Thank God, first of all, for even giving you the grace to acquire the place. It's not easy, okay? So you ought to thank God. Appreciate Him. So you ought to be thanking God for what He has done and what He's about to do. Now you're going to thank God. After thanking God, hold that sun in your hand and call your name three times and call say God I am using this sand as a point of contact. You are talking to God but you are using the sand as a point of communication, as a point of contact. Talking to God. This is called practical prayer. Lord I am taking charge over this power, every powers of this land. The particular place. If maybe probably you know the name of the street or the name of the market where your shop is and all that. Begin to call it. Say God, I am taking charge. I am taking authority. I am taking every. So you begin to pray. After praying, hmm? keep the sand. Tomorrow when you go back to that shop, just sprinkle the sand there and say, as I sprinkle you back to where I picked you from, you will bless me. You will usher me into the realm of abundance. My dear, move on. Do the prayer just for three days. Every three days, you pack the new, like every day, pack the new one. After praying, you go back and do that for three days. Now, generally, whether you have a shop or you don't have a shop, but things are not going well in your life, things are very, very bad, you've tried a lot of things, pack a sand anywhere, either in your house, your shop, your main road, anywhere. Sand is sand. Pack a sand. When you pack this sand, when it's 12 o'clock midnight, maybe your life is all ups and down. Things are not going well with you. You have tried, you've labeled, you worked and all that and no positive results. Now read Psalm 35 and read Psalm 91. After reading the psalm, begin to talk to God using the sand. Tell God that this poverty that today is over. Tell God that this particular affliction, that this is the end. Tell God that this particular nightmare, this particular rising and falling, this appointment, whatever that is, begin to point them. Don't say everything. No. Be pointing them one after the other. Be talking to God, naming them, telling God, this is what I am praying using this thing. Sometimes the reason why you are not getting an answer, you thought God doesn't answer pray because you don't know how to act. You just say, oh, everything. Everything is everything. So what is that thing? Begin to mention them. Talk to God. Say, God, this lack of money, Lord, this sickness, God, this disappointment, God, this late of marriage, God, begin to call that particular thing. Then after, I'm talking based on people that want to use it. Maybe there is something you are praying for, you understand. Then after that, round it in your head three times. Go outside your house, anywhere. Sprinkle the sand. The next day, pack another new sand. Still pray like that again. Do it like that for three days and I wait your testimony. Generally, maybe you want to embark in a place or maybe you relocated to a country or a state for the first time. Okay, now pack the sand from the place. Pack the sand from the place. Either probably the compound you packed in or the as long as it's in that state, anywhere, just get a sand. All right, talk to the sun. Say, I am, I am here now. Talk to the, talk to God using the sun. Say, oh, you land. They are talking to the land of the place. That here I am. I am now a new visitor, or I am now your friend. You begin to bless yourself. You will bless me. You will be a blessing to me. Everything I do in this state, in this country, will work for me. I came here. I will go with full blessings of God. I will go with every good things of this land, every good things of this country. You begin to speak to God using that method. By 12, 1, 2, or 3, do this prayer. After doing it, don't run that one on your head, please. 
for this particular one don't round it on your head after you don't pray in those things just go anywhere and throw away the sand and watch out what is going to happen i wish you could know the spiritual benefit of this this assignment you will come back with your testimony this is so powerful this is so amazing this is so miraculously so just try it but promise me one thing you will surely come back to testify so guys i've come to the end of this video i promise to share more with you another way to use sand to break out from causes to break out from so many health or spiritual issues that they are going through so subscribe or follow me so you don't miss out any in this one please share this video to help someone like it and see you in my next very well. I love you and stay blessed. See you in my next video. Bye.